In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to print a QuickBooks deposit detail report and we'll walk through the process step by step to ensure everything is clear and easy to follow. Let's get started right away. First, you need to sign into your QuickBooks account. If you're not already on the login page, simply navigate to the QuickBooks online website. Once you're there, click on the sign in button, which you can usually find at the top right corner of the web page. Enter your credentials, your username and password and hit continue to access your account. Be sure to double check your credentials to avoid any login issues. Now that you're logged in, it's time to head over to the report section. This is where you'll find the deposit detail information we want to print. You can get to the report section through the main navigation menu, typically located on the left side of your QuickBooks interface. If you can't find it, look for an icon that represents a document or a graph. That's typically where reports are housed in the application. Once you're in the report section, there's a search bar on the right side of the page. You can use this feature to quickly locate specific reports. Type in deposit detail into the search bar. As you start typing, QuickBooks will auto suggest reports that match your query. When you see deposit detail in the list of options, click on it to access the report. After selecting the deposit detail report, you'll see a new window with detailed information regarding all the deposits you've made. Take a moment to review the information here to ensure it's what you need. It's important to check any available date range options to get the exact data you want included in your report. With your report open and verified, look towards the top right corner of your screen where you will see an option labeled more actions. Click on this to reveal a drop down menu. From here, you have several actions to choose from. For printing or saving your deposit detail report, you'll want to click on the option Print Save as PDF. As a final step, decide whether you want to print the document directly or save it as a PDF to your computer first. If you opt to print the document, make sure your printer is properly set up and connected. Alternatively, if you're saving it as a PDF, choose the destination on your computer where you'd like to store the file. This can be beneficial if you want to share the report digitally or print it later. And there you have it, in just a few steps you've successfully printed or saved a QuickBooks deposit detail report. I hope this guide was helpful. Feel free to revisit any section if you need additional clarity. Thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial.